Hey beauties, it's Riri. If you're new here, I'm an over 40 lover of all things beauty and I love showcasing indie brands here on my channel. If that sounds like your cup of tea, please consider subscribing and giving the video a thumbs up before you leave. It really does help my channel so much. And if you want to see some more of me with this fantastic lighting, tap your notification bell so you never miss an upload. Um, it is 9 a.m. I just received my mystery boxy charm boxes, so I wanted to hurry up and get this up for you guys. I hope that you guys are enjoying Dorismas, and I'm having a blast, and I hope that you guys are as well. So, I received this email right around Black Friday, and I was like, that's a pretty damn good deal, considering the boxy charm is more than this price for one. But, you get two mystery boxy charms for $24, you guys. That is 10 full size items for $24. I had to jump on that. And if you are not new here, then you know I've been on a no buy. So when I'm buying things right now, it's with thoughtfulness and intention, but I just couldn't pass it up. That's $2.40 a product. So we're going to dive in. This one feels pretty girthy and heavy. And I don't know if you can tell, but whatever's in here is like bigger than what the box is basically. This one also feels kind of heavy. So we're gonna dive in let me know if you got in on this deal or not i have no scissors i have no nothing i literally was in the middle of drinking my coffee and editing a different video for today <laughs> um and i was like "Ooh, the doorbell let me see who's there so my little card just says boxy charm candy shop all of our stuff's on the back i'm not gonna look all right first up is the tarte maracuja miracle mist setting spray I don't like the sprays that are like this. I just find that they're inconsistent. I personally just don't like these. Um, but the regular Tarte, like glowy setting spray, big fan of. And I see one of my favorite products of all time, ever, ever, ever in here already. And these are literally $16 to $20 each. And normally in the boxy pop-up, they're about $4 to $5 each. But it is a sponge gel. If you know, you know. Myself and Caleb are obsessed. Um, it's a sponge gel, Cherry Tonka Musk. I love these so, so much. Um, like literally a few months back, I got Caleb like nine or 10 sponge gels. That's how much we love them. I've gifted them. I will note if you're on the fence about these or you've never tried these, the very first time you use them and a couple times maybe after you first use them, they're quite scratchy and abrasive. It really didn't bother me. Um, but if you have extremely tender skin, very reactive skin, sensitive skin, it's abrasive the first time you use it. So just to know. But as you use them more and you soften them up and you lather them up really well and wet them and you wet them really well, you don't have that issue. So very excited. Next up is another item that I've used and I really, really like. And I love this color. <laughs> it's the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Kiss Tinted Cupuaco lip butter and this one is in a deeper shade than what i had before it's called soulmate so that is what it looks like and it is in the shade soulmate should we try it out i think we shall oh it's so pretty i don't have a mirror i'm just gonna rely on this um i like that this particular lip balm or lip product has a little bit of kind of weight to it like it stays in place which i really really love next up do i have two palettes Yes, I do, bitch. Woo. First up is a Beauty Bakery Breakfast in Bed eyeshadow palette. Excited. And of course, whatever I don't use, we can put it in our pay it forward pile. I can put it in my for sale group. Oh, very pretty. I know a ton of my friends that would love this. It is definitely more like purpley, mauve -y. Not my personal vibes, but still super excited to have this. And another palette, this is the Real Her Ultimate Glow Getter Cheek Trio. And the Real Her Brow Pencil is one of my all-time favorite Holy Grail products. I do just want to open this and see what it looks like to see if I would actually get some use out of it. Very cute. It has like a blushy shade, a bronzer shade, and then a highlight shade. That is cute as heck. I also am not going to keep this just because I don't need it. So I, you know, I try to not be wasteful with product, but all right, y'all super excited. Two palettes, the lip product, the sponge gel, and then the setting spray for 12 bucks. All right, we're going to go into the next one. I'm just going to rip the box. <laughs> and I do recycle FYI. And I also reuse packaging when I do like my for sale group and stuff like that. Um, so it's the same exact thing. Let me see if this actually had the deets on the back. 
Yeah, I did. Okay, the Beauty Bakery Breakfast in Bed Eyeshadow Palette is $38. The Tarte Spray is $23. The Real Her Glow Getter Cheek Trio is $28. The Sol de Janeiro is $20. And the Sponge Gel is $20. That's a fantastic value. So the, the card says the same thing. Again, I don't want to look at it just yet. And the first thing right on top is a Frank Body Glow Mask Caffeinated. Is this hair or body? <laughs> I mean, it says Frank Body. It doesn't actually say. Oh, yes, it does. I'm just... I, I need my glasses on. Glow on, I dare you. For bouncy skin, apply a thick layer two to three times per week. Massage it into the skin, leave on for 10 minutes, rinse and glow. I'm lazy as hell. I like to put my skincare on and let it do what it's supposed to do. And I don't like to come back and have to wash it off. So I probably won't keep this, but I think it's nice. I think it's nice to have. Next up is a Farsali Quench Replenishing Serum. Hydrate and replenish. <laughs> if you're new here, I'm very sorry. <laughs> it's a shit show around here, okay? But it's an honest shit show. So I actually want to try this. I, I think I had this before. I swear I did. But because I don't have anything on my complexion right now, I want to try it. And it feels super duper cold, so it's probably going to feel incredible on my skin. So it is a nice thick serum. I really enjoy thick serums. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh gosh, that feels nice. <laughs> Especially with it being cold. That feels incredible. It might wake my ass up too. I mean, I've been up since 6.50, but am I up? N no. <laughs> <sighs> I've already gotten on the bike though this morning. Already started clothes. Was working on my video that was going to go up today. I'm sorry I keep adding some, but man, does that feel good. It's nice and cold. The texture is really, really nice has a little bit of a slip to it. It's not tacky or anything like that. I like that. All right, next is a Ace Beauté, the Draw It Lip Liner in the shade. It just says Lip Liner Duo Set. I don't know. We'll find out. That's what the packaging looks like. I really like Ace Beauté overall as a brand. I think they have a fantastic eyeshadow formula. If I can get these out, hello. All right, cute, cute. It's more of like a berry shade and then a neutrally like brown shade. I have enough liners, so I'm also not going to keep these, but I'm not mad at having them. And thus far, I think both boxes have been well curated. Y'all, $24 for both boxes. Did you get in on this deal? <gasps> Luxy brushes. Ooh, I'm excited, I'm excited. 90% of my brushes have come from subscription boxes. And I can't get these out of the damn package. Please don't mess up the bristles. Here we go. Oh, very nice. It is a five-piece eye set. Oh, yeah. I'm excited. That's cool as hell. I'm excited. And then I have a palette here, too. This is the Ciate London The Editor Palette. Let me see what this looks like, too. It feels really heavy. All right. Oh, that's pretty. Okay. Please be something I'll use. Please be something I'll use. It's okay. Um, definitely more my vibe versus the other palette, but I definitely feel like I have plenty of palettes that are quite similar. So I'm also not going to keep this, but again, I'm not mad at it. Um, I literally was just super curious and I was like, dude, holy crap. Freaking... This is a lot of product for $24. So in this one, we got our brushes and the eyeshadow, the lip liners, the Farsali, which I am keeping, and then the Frank Body. If I didn't have to like rinse this off and that's just me being lazy as hell, um, then I would keep that too because the one Frank Body lotion we got a long time ago, love, obsessed with. Um, I'm obsessed. I think this is a fantastic value. Hopefully you guys saw this and were able to get in on this. Let me know what you thought. Was it worth our $24? Comment down below. I love you beauties. Stay happy, healthy, and safe. And of course, be your own best beautiful. Bye beauties.